Good evening. The Albuquerque teacher accused of having sex with a 13-year-old student has harmed a lot of other kids, too. That was the message tonight from frustrated and worried parents as they met with officials at Jimmy Carter Mid-School. And boy, did they have plenty to say. News 13's Alex Tomlin was there. Diane, while school officials would not discuss the rape case against Christy Sanchez Trujillo, they did talk with parents about the impact of this on their children. One parent says they're getting rid of every sign of Christy Sanchez Trujillo. My daughter was saying something about changes happening today, about things coming off the walls and different things like that, and that was a little difficult for her. Kids at Jimmy Carter Middle School are still reeling after learning that 7th grade social studies teacher Christy Sanchez Trujillo had sex with one of her students. She stood before a Metro Court judge today and agreed not to go back to the school or see the victim again. Tonight on campus, one parent said she's shocked, but is more concerned for her 7th grade son, who is not the victim but is being teased. An eighth grader was like, who got the, you know, got the lucky shot? What other teachers can we get? That kind of thing. Her son told her what else is being said to him. That was a lucky boy. That's what my son said. Are you the seventh grader that got lucky? And that kind of stuff just doesn't fly with me. Administrators tried to assure the Crown they're doing what they can to hold down hall gossip. But parents questioned whether the school missed red flags. In her classroom, she stated that she left her cell phone over to Administrators said no concerns were ever brought to them. Santra Trujillo also had no previous criminal record. Administrators say they're working to help kids and parents maintain trust in their instructors. This is an anomaly. And our teachers are our confident, our confidence, and teachers, uh, students' confidence, and they are the pers first person on the line that those kids would go to. Parents want this behind them. To move forward and work with my son, and let's get back to social studies. Administrators say they will take parents' concerns back to Superintendent Winston Brooks, who is out of town. Sandra Trujillo is free on bond. Back to you. Okay, Alex, many people have asked News 13 about the responsibility of the victim's parents since the teen had reportedly stayed out with Sanchez Trujillo until 5 in the morning. Albuquerque police say the parents are not at fault and they have found no neglect.